Welcome back, my name is Dak, and today at the Brew Tank, we are racking the sizer. As always, we start off by sanitizing our workspace. Next, we will set up our sizer for siphoning. Make sure to elevate your carboy with the mead above the carboy you're transferring to. Gravity will do the rest once you get it started. Once that's in place and adjusted an inch above the lease, let's get to siphoning. Now before I forget, let's take a gravity reading and a taste test. Always keep your tools and graduated cylinder clean and sanitized for this part because you may need to pour it back in to reduce the headspace. Looks like we have a reading of 1.05. So this is going to be a pretty sweet mead. And for the best part, I'll pour up a glass for me and my cameraman, and let's see how this sizer tastes. Wow, this one's pretty sweet. I can taste the apple, but the alcohol is pretty forward and the sweetness is pretty overpowering. So hopefully it mellows out with age and the apple juice shines through. I'll come back to this one later and refine it more once I read up a little on sizers. After all the siphoning and testing is done, we're going to seal it up with some fresh vodka with a clean airlock and that's it. And that's all for today. This will end up staying in here for just a few days before I go ahead and bottle, given that there's way too much headspace. Thanks for joining me for some siphoning, and I hope some of you out there give this sizer a shot. Hit me with a like and subscribe if you want to see more, and I hope you try out your own sizers in the comment section below. Have a great day, and happy brewing! Cheers!